Lipscomb's three-game winning streak comes to an end. They lose to Liberty here this afternoon, 65-56. to Jonathan and Justin Steven courtside with head coach Lauren Sumsky. Coach, uh, right, right where you really wanted going to get to the fourth quarter, then a big run by the Flames. Yeah, we gave the ball away too much, and I, I thought that was the difference for us. Um, the reality is we felt like we just need to get shots, and we just kept handing the ball and giving really easy twos, and that's something that we didn't want to do coming into the game. Coach, I thought the, the good part, uh, you know, you have to look at everything in this game. You don't like the result, but first three quarters, you know, you get, your girls were fighting the whole – they were pretty much behind the whole game. Yeah. I mean, we looked at halftime, and or the third quarter, they had been uh, leading by about 26 minutes. Y'all only led for about two minutes. You got to like the fight, and you, you're right there in the fourth quarter up by three. I mean, that's where you want it to be. And then how about your bench tonight? I, I thought Claire McGowan and Molly Hurd really kind of helped you guys out a big time. Definitely. I, I thought that today our youth showed a little bit. There were some times we didn't execute yeah. things exactly the way we wanted to, um, whether it was missing a screen or missing a cut or just blowing up an action altogether offensively. I thought we definitely struggled more offensively than defensively today, and uh, other than giving the ball away. Yeah, the turnovers hurt, but you're right. Offensively, you, you struggle a little bit. You had to call some early timeouts, so there yeah. in the fourth quarter, you really didn't have them to use. No, and, and I feel like you can't go into this game anymore without having at least one timeout, um, let alone two you know, in the fourth quarter and had to call one early, uh, made a challenge. I thought that, um, obviously, thought that I was right in that situation, but the ref disagreed. And, and sometimes that just happens. But, uh, you know, we want to fight for our players in those situations. And, again, um, we just ran out of gas a little bit there at the end and didn't execute down the stretch. But you, you got to love the fight, too, because you're up three going into the fourth quarter. They go on a 15-2 to two run. You're down 10 yeah. with about – you know, five, six minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Then you guys go up on a 6-0 run. Mm -hmm. You have the ball down four, yeah. and then it was that one turnover. That one it's just turnover. that little thing. Yeah. But, I mean, still, there's so much still to build on is all I'm pointing with a young For team sure. like this. Oh, no doubt. These are situations we learn from. Mm -hmm. um, and, and more than what happened, it's how we did it. And uh, I think that we would all agree there are some things we need to clean up and execute a little bit better. But I am proud of our fight always. Uh, this team doesn't lay down. This team doesn't get discouraged. Uh, they were committed to the game plan even when it didn't really feel good. And like I said, I thought we had a chance to cut it to two, and we just gave the ball away and for too easy of a, a basket in this kind of game. Probably at the beginning of the year, if someone told you it'd be 7-2 after first half of the A's, you'd say, we can battle with that. <laughs> for sure, for sure. You know, our, our girls fight. They play hard. Um, you know, we give all glory to God all the time. But, um, you know, proud of where we are. I know that we're halfway. We're yep. halfway. Uh, not done and just got to get, keep getting better every day. So now you got to go on the road for a couple to restart the A Sun. Uh, mm -hmm. Be going up to Eastern Kentucky. Uh, so what do you do to get the team ready now? Uh, right now, I think we have to understand what happened here and what we need to clean up and then um, just, you know, get ready to move forward and know that, you know, this is one game out of a, a 16 or excuse me, 18 games played or however many uh, and know that we just have to keep getting better. That's all that it's about right now for us. Well, it's been a lot of fun through this half. I got a feeling the second half is going to be just as much fun. Well, we sure hope so. Well, <laughs> tough luck on the loss today. Congratulations, Coach. Let's get ready to go get them in Eastern Kentucky. Thanks. Coach Thanks. Lauren Sumsky with us. Lady Bisons or the Bisons lose here 65-56. to 56. You can keep up with everything happening with Lipscomb Sports at LipscombSports.com.